Hey y'all, Jaja Cook Bay here. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to day one of our seven day soup challenge. Let's get into it. You see what we're about to do? Vegan faux soup, y'all. So you're gonna get started with your fresh ginger alongside with the red onion. I didn't have white onion, so I used red onion. We're going to put this in the oven. You're gonna prep your oven to 425 and voila you see that you're gonna leave this in here for about like 20 minutes okay so now that we have that in the oven we're gonna prep our spices we're gonna roast our coriander peppercorn clove and cinnamon this is just gonna give the faux its unique you know faux taste this is what's gonna really make this faux soup so i add a little bit of water to preserve all these flavors and make it more easier to um add to our broth that we're about to make next okay so this is our broth you're gonna add your sesame oil um your sea salt your cayenne pepper after your cayenne pepper we're gonna add smoked salt just to give it a little bit of a eggy flavor <laughs> and after that you're gonna put your chipotle pepper just a little bit not too much okay and uh, what I didn't show is I also added dill and onion powder, okay? So you're going to lightly roast this. This should be a very quick process. <laughs> then you're going to add your mushroom, your scallions, and then you're going to add your water for this broth, y'all. This is... This turned out so amazing. So after that, y'all, you're gonna take your earlier your earl the mixture that we made earlier. I can't talk. And you see how even the water soaked everything up. I still had to add water to the pan just to make sure I got all the flavors infused in there. And um, and right before this step, y'all, what I also didn't include is that I took the ginger and the red onion from the oven and I put it in the broth. Okay. Yes. Stir, put it in there so you're gonna stir it up stir it up stir it up stir it up yes sir so after that y'all you're going it should look a little something like this <laughs> so after that you're gonna add your coconut aminos and your agave i didn't show the agave but i put agave in there in replacement of the rock sugar which is traditionally used in this soup so then you're going to get your thinly sliced portobello mushroom i added um seasoned salt ah, onion powder and coconut aminos and then you're going to let all those flavors simmer for about 20 minutes on the stove you see i already added my zucchini noodles to its water which only had sea salt and sesame oil. Sesame oil was the only oil that I used throughout this whole process, y'all. So then now you're gonna take your drained noodles, add that to this to the to your soup bowl. Then you can get your broth. Look how yummy this broth looked, y'all. This broth came out fire. Oh, also what I added to the broth was some sage and more dry seasonings. Okay, all of the dry seasonings that we used earlier. Um, then you're going to add your you know beef replacement. <laughs> which is the portable mushroom y'all man then you're gonna add your fresh basil okay we're gonna get into these toppings y'all they're gonna add your red bell pepper which is gonna be in replacement of the thai chili then you're gonna add your scallions i don't like bean sprouts so hence why you don't see this in here <laughs> then you're gonna add your culantro not cilantro culantro y'all and yeah and your soup should look a little something like this y'all oh i almost forgot you're gonna add your key lime which it, which gives it like it's je ne sais quoi all right and yeah y'all that's about it this came out so bomb guys i actually never had faux before i just watched a whole bunch of youtube videos and the way i made this i don't know if it's supposed to taste like this but this tastes amazing okay so now you can see i have my ghetto soup spoon because i don't have a real one <laughs> and i took my chopsticks and turned it around because this is the traditional way to eat faux soup and yeah y'all this this came out so bomb guys i i can see why people are addicted to faux okay <laughs> I can, I can definitely see why this came out so good i'm so proud of myself y'all uh, thanks for watching y'all don't forget to rate comment and subscribe let me know what you think about this recipe and i'll see y'all tomorrow on day two of the seven day soup challenge are y'all ready <laughs> bye